Patrice from Spresso Tour County Corso. I'm out here with Melina. It's about to blow a huge thunderstorm. Um, we have been under like some sort of heat wave um, since I've been back from Texas. So if any of you guys tuned in to our live stream, um, I was in Texas for like literally just two days. It was, um, hmm, I'm trying to think. I'm not going to get her pooping because it's rude. Um, but I was there, well, I left on a Thursday. I didn't get there until like late, late Thursday because I missed my flight, my connection flight into Austin. And so um, I had to catch like the next flight um, that that boarded and took off like mm, like three hours later so I was really there for like two solid days and like a half of a day and that was really it but I went down there to um help Rachel over there at Sense of Tempo um just kind of pack up the house and um, I've been helping her with her home buying process and everything like that. So anyway, it was just more so of like a business visit and I did get to do some things that I wanted to do. I wanted to always go to the Selena Museum um, for a very, very long time. I've wanted to go since I was a little girl. So that was just kind of like a dream come true for me. Come on, Melina. But I'm back, and I'm back to business. Um, we are now on puppy watch for Melina. As you guys can see, she is huge. She is humongous. She's got teats, and the last time she just had nipples with milk. <laughs> so um, it looks like she's going to be having a good size litter, but we'll see. I mean, we will see what she has. She looks definitely bigger than the first litter um which we were hoping for and uh she was bred to italian champion natuno um natuno is a fantastic dog i will be posting this breeding on my website um probably after she has the puppies i pro possibly will have spots open we will see. We may have spots available on this. Um, if you are interested, you have to fill out a puppy application ASAP or you will not get on the litter. Um, I do have some applications that came in last week. And uh, Melina, come here. Um, but I haven't had the opportunity to review them yet. I'm still... Um, well... I got home Sunday. Um, I left Texas. My flight took off 6 a.m. So I didn't even get to sleep on Saturday going into Sunday. So Sunday I got home. I got a lot of rest. Melina! Melina, come here. Come. I don't like her in that grass because... Melina, come. Melina! Come here, girl. She does not, all she wants to do is nest. Come here, girl. I don't really want her in that grass because it's a little taller and snakes are coming out. And um, even though we don't really have, um, I guess the most venomous snakes in Virginia are toxic snakes. Um, a poisonous venomous snake bite is a poisonous ven venomous snake bite. Melina, come now. Come on. So, um, I don't want her to do that. Come on. Melina, come to this side. She is, like, really not going to listen to me. Look how big she is. She is, like, big. She, she is like a queen ant. <laughs> She is bussing. <laughs> she is literally like, I guess, bussing out of herself. She gets any bigger, I don't know what I'm going to do. Because um, we have her, well, we really didn't know when exactly she bred. Um, 
the breeder that she was with was not able to document um, the exact date of the start of breeding because she was really, really super busy when Melina was there. Um, Melina, come on. So we just kind of had to guesstimate and then I took her for her ultrasound and whatever. Um, I don't do um, the x-rays unless I feel it's a very small litter and small litters actually are more complicated than large litters. Um, so, ooh, you guys, come see my hydrangeas. My hydrangea flowers are so pretty. I need to weed. I need to weed and look at that hydrangea. I bought this last year and usually they grow so slow, but these have grown um, very nicely. They've, they've like tripled their growth. Melina, come here. Come on. So, um,. It is going, look at the sky. It is definitely going to be a surprise. I hope you guys tune in. Hopefully, you guys can tune in to this. Um, I spent Monday putting her um, box together. So, I haven't been on because I've just been trying to get prepared. Um, my kid is closing out on the school year. Yay. That's going to be... That's going to free me up a lot um, for YouTube is my kids actually going to school next year. Because even though like I'm, I'm doing this video, I got to go in and I have to um, work on work on homework, getting everything turned in. So how many do you guys think she's going to have? I'm going to get level gonna let y'all look at her in all her glory what do you guys think how many do you, are you guys thinking she's definitely a bit larger than she was the first time in my opinion in my opinion she looks like a cow in my opinion let me get some some yoni action back here things are jiggling she's like no you don't get to get my yoni yeah i'm gonna get it just so you guys can see like how low she goes. <laughs> Here she is in all her glory. But um, I'm back. I made it home safe. Um, I probably will be very, very busy um, with things even after Melina has her litter because Rachel's moving up and I have to help her and there's home inspection um, for her new house on Friday I have to be at because she's not physically here so I have to be there with the realtor it is extremely busy so if you have called me or you have sent me an email and I have not gotten back with you it's not that I'm rude, it's just that I've been super busy, um, even gone out of my state, and now I am back. So you guys, um, hopefully the next time you see us, it's on the live stream, I will make a post to let you know um, when in fact we are on actual factual puppy watch. I'm going to be taking temperature probably starting tomorrow morning, um, because for me, she seems very... Uh, we had her marked for the 21st. Well, the 18th through the 21st. But um, she's losing some mucus plug, I believe, little by little. So we have her... If she's going to go now, we have her Sunday. So we'll see. We'll see. Hopefully it comes on the week weekend and not the weekday. But I will keep everyone posted. You will know. I will hopefully be able to live stream this one. We all know um, Melina tends to be... Um, nothing comes easy with Melina. Ain't it, girl? Say so nothing comes easy. Say so we, we pooed in and a puppy fell out the last time. So this time we're shooting for the stars. <laughs> Alright, you guys. I will talk to you later. See you later, guys. Bye-bye.